Hello, my name is Chris. This is the Camille Corp. And uh, this is my proof of life. So, <laughs> I had every intention of lining up a bunch of content to release over the course of the last few weeks. Um, clearly, that didn't happen. Uh, I think we got one uniform review, and then there was one uh, spacement build uh, where we were working on the MDF for the beams. But, you know, there have been several things going on in my personal life over the last few weeks and uh, it just it exhausts me and like it just any motivation I had to, to do things has just kind of taken a back burner to everything else going on in my life and it got me to thinking the pressure that people are under and I'm in this case I'm speaking specifically you know as a creator someone who produces things and produces content you know the the pressure to put things out at regular in intervals you know professional looking videos that are edited and sound good which admit admittedly hasn't been a strong point recently but there is no opportunity for somebody who's creating to let their foot off the gas and still have what they're trying to do work for them. I would I would say back in May and coming into the beginning of June, but you know, this channel was doing really well. You're gaining a bunch of followers, views were higher than they'd ever been. Um, and a lot of that's tapered off. Uh, and some of that's because I haven't been putting out regular content. Some of that is because I, you know, a lot of what I was getting views on were the Mandalorian builds. And I think after the final season, not final, the, the one that just aired, the, the last season of the Mandalorian came out, there was just a buzz of excitement around the Mandalorian build. And I, and I think some of that has faded as well. And there hasn't been another hot button item kind of pop up to take its place but I'm, and this is not me complaining right this is just me doing a couple of things one letting you know that I'm still here uh, to those of you who support the channel on patreon I appreciate that so much uh, and that you know you've you've stuck stuck through while the content hasn't exactly been flowing like, I know we've been chatting on the Discord server, and I've, I've put some new 3D models up in the library and things like that, but uh, I feel like, as far as, like, build videos and things like that, clearly I haven't been hitting the mark on those. Uh, second reason is, you know, you just think about this capitalist society we live in, where there's so much emphasis on producing you know, if you, if you aren't actively producing or busy, then you're lazy, and that is that is not the case. Uh, everybody needs time to recharge batteries. Everybody needs time to sit back, take a deep breath, focus on some things outside of production, and you can also take that time to to just revel in what you've been able to accomplish. But the fact, you know, intrinsically, your worth is not tied to what you're producing, right? No matter what society would like you to believe, your worth is tied to you as a person, as a unique individual who brings joy, inspiration, contentedness, whatever those things are to those around you. You know, if you're a spouse, or a parent, or just a really good friend, I, you know, those those are the things that really matter in life. Ultimately, if I'm on my deathbed and I haven't gotten 
a thousand subscribers on this channel? Am I going to remorsefully proclaim my life was a failure? No, of course not. I like making content. I like putting things up on YouTube. I love the interaction with everybody who's commenting and everybody who's on the Discord and things like that. But yeah, it's just one of many things that we do with our lives. And I think our parents, that boomer generation, really tied their self-worth to what they produced, what they did with their jobs. You know, I think back, and I was actually talking to my wife about this uh, a couple days ago, it's like, think about adults now versus adults in the 80s and the 90s, right? Like, we're out here wearing you know, pop culture t-shirts, uh, getting tattoos, doing crazy shit with our hair. We're doing all this stuff. And our parents, it seems like as soon as they got out of school, they went from having fun and dressing like a kid, kid, to polos and khakis and going into the office and dropping every hobby that they might have enjoyed like you know if I think back growing up I'm like well what did my dad like to do I have no idea my dad worked a lot you know they, he didn't have something that I really associate with him you know really enjoying to do and so you know I, I kind of hold that close because you know I, I think hobbies and gaining enjoyment for life from life are so important and uh, I want to be able to show my kids that you don't have to stop having fun when you grow up, right? You don't have to ditch the things that brought you joy just because you're an adult. I'm not sure I really had a point to this, uh, and I, <laughs> I tell you what, if you made it this far in the video, go ahead and leave a comment letting me know. Because uh, usually when I put content out like this, my average view length on these things is under 45 seconds. Um, so if you're at the eight minute mark and you've watched all of this, and if any of it resonated with you, I'd love to know. And I'm sure other people would love to know too. So again, thank you for the patience as real life unfolds. Uh, thank you for, you know, watching. Uh, thank you for your support uh, financially if you're a member of our Patreon. I usually say keep creating, which I still believe, but maybe, maybe take a break here and there too. We will see you next time with some sort of a build video or a review or something. I, I promise. Cross my heart and all that shit. So, thank you. Have a great time. We will see you next time.